just around the corner, folks. We're only a couple of weeks away. It's Jude Vice. And before I hand things off to Sean Andrews and Donnie Kong, I want to remind you to get those tickets. And especially because the realist is going one-on-one -on -one against the big dog. His championship's on the line. Donnie talks to the champ. I'm KCXW announcer Donnie Kong, and I'm here with Calvin Aldridge, the realist, our KCXW Kansas City champion. Since October 2022, you've taken down all comers, and I just want to know what you think sets you apart from the rest of the competitors in KCXW. What sets me apart? I mean, let's be real. Nobody is different from anybody. We all eat to live. We all got to breathe. We all got to blink. We all got to sleep. But I'm the guy who's not afraid to say that I make mistakes. I mess up. I call people out on their mistakes. They're too afraid to hear that. So it's not that I'm different. It's that I'm real. And keeping with that theme, to be real with you, a lot of the people you've been giving chances lately are unproven competitors, XWC students, and I just want to know how they compare to your upcoming opponent and the big dog. So three things there. First of all, don't don't use real against the realist. Second of all, are you trying to put down these students? These students have been working their asses off. What you mean? They the, they the best that the Midwest got to offer. You trying to say that I'm I'm hiding? That I'm that I'm not trying to face the best of the best? What what is that? And I, I would never take away from your previous opponents, but Big Dog has the, an experience edge that you haven't seen yet, and you said you weren't going to be taking on any prior That let, let me let me stop you right there because that was a joke, right? I saw that on Saturday Slam. That, that was a joke. Facing, I can't face Big Dog. Didn't I tell you guys when I won the KCXW Championship that these old guys, they're the past. They don't get chances in my title. And the championship committee recognizes that Big Dog has never held the KCXW Kansas City Championship. That, that, you know, you know that that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant. I meant that the, they're in the past. They don't deserve to have a title shot. This is mine. This is this is a new generation of Kansas City wrestling. I hate to use your own words against you, but the reality check is, according to your challenge, he fits the criteria. No one is trying to pull a fast one on you. I see what it is. KCXW at it again. Doesn't matter, though. Don't matter if it's Big Dog, JC Thunder. Don't matter if they bring back some wrestler from the dead. All that matters is that the realist will still be your Kansas City champion and unleashed. Because you people, no matter how hard you think about it, you're living in my world, the realist world. I'm done here, man. These cameras out of my face. I'll do respect to the champion and his previous challengers, but the biggest test of his championship defense so far in KCXW at KCXW Unleashed, April 22nd. KC Soccer Nation against Big Dog. Bert Candy! So nice. You get him twice, folks. Bert Candy. Here he comes, the candy man himself. Still just as smooth as the first time. Double Absolutely love bird candy. Bird. We believe in bird candy. And his opponent, being accompanied to the ring by the one percenter Richard Goldman and Tobias Storm, the marksman, Gerard Javorski. I believed in bird candy until I realized his opponent was the marksman. Yes, while we may have prematurely placed our belief, it's still okay to have faith but it doesn't look good. Oh, 
Marksman's been a man. There he is. The Marksman. And my guy, Tobias. Tobias Storm and Richard Cole. I'm not doing that, man. This team right here, Tobias and the Marksman, solid gold right here. Absolutely. This team right here has been shocking. This looks to be an unstoppable team. Underhanded as you can get in the new spirit stuff. And that's just one of the things I like about it. There's one thing I know about these three is they're up to no good. Tobias just making friends wherever he goes. Quite frankly, I don't like the feeling I get with these three. It sends a chill down my spine. I love to hear what they have to say. Plus, it'll get you out of here. There's just something about the marksman. I can't put my finger on it. I feel like he can do anything once he gets in this ring. He's had a sick look in his eyes lately. The marksman is a man of two words. Good. You're next to Tobias, you're not going to get a word in other ones. That may be what makes them a great team. I, I can't put my finger on it, but these two are so good for each other, it's almost bad. I'm seeing gold in their future. And not just for your gold. Golden out of the way. What are you calling? Golden out of the way. Come on. Turn it down a hug for Bird Candy. Bird Candy right. calling That's Richard a, Goldman right. Tiger Woods. Very Tiger Woods wishes he had kind of money that Richard Goldman does. Believe me, I know. One thing I will say, I do know Richard Goldman is a better driver than Tiger Woods. I've seen his car, there's not a scratch on him. Yeah, you're great. You're great. Other than that, I don't see the complaint. Let's have a moment of silence out here for the The fans clearly not listening to Tobias. Burt Candy put the old switcheroo on Marksman, and the Marksman is not having it. I'm going to tell you, the Marksman is not somebody to poke fun of. This is going to come back to bite Bert Candy. You got to pull it back. You got to pull it back. serious. Come you got him. Yeah. Candy up to his usual head games. Again, I don't think this is a smart move on Bert Candy's part. He's only making the marksman angry. I'm a very grown up adult. Yeah, I'm a little kid. No, I'm a little kid. Bert Candy engaging in a debate with Tobias Storm ringside. I don't know if he should be paying any attention to that young man. Bert Candy, solid right back. Knee lift. Marksman letting him know. Marks been getting the better of Candy. Some blows to the face. Now this is exactly what I was talking about earlier. You do not want to make the marksman angry. Marksman very focused. Candy with his fun-loving, freewheeling style. The fun loving stopping now, folks. The marksman is as technically sound as anyone here in KCXW. A big splash from Marksman. Candy shaking off the splash, got him in the bear hug into a Candy suplex. Belly to belly suplex. Marksman rolling out of the ring smartly. Richard Goldman's got his back. As so much fun as Candy likes to have, he loves to wrestle too. And I think Marksman needs to keep that in mind. This match spilling out into the crowd. Candy with a big shot to the face. Nothing fun about that, folks. Gets the marksman back in the ring. You know, this is actually a more serious side of Bert Candy than I think we've ever seen. The thing about Bert Candy is once the action gets going, 
That's right. He is a serious wrestler once you Very serious to get him going, but this drop, drop kick the by the marksman. Marksman remains focused. Intent on dealing as much damage to Burke Candy as he can outside the ring. He's just watching this like a hawk. Goes in for the pinfall. Only a two count. In some ways, this is almost a three on one. You've got two people thinking how loud on the outside of the ring, and then you've got the marksman inside of the ring handling the dirty work. You know, it almost sounds like the fans cheering for Burt Candy is just making the marksman angry. Marksman grinding his tape into the forehead of Burt Candy, just a little extra ear in him. Elbow to the midsection, breaks free. Ducks that shot, takes out the knee. There goes the marksman. Again, supporting my theory. He's the most technically sound wrestler. Marksman very deliberate in his attack. Dangerous Holy wrestler. Yeah! And now that he's teaming up with Tobias and Richard Goldman, could be unstoppable, folks. Marksman candy gonna tap pretzel. out. Tobias is demoralizing Candy from the right side. Storm calling for Candy soft. Candy taken down with thunderous suplex. By a storm, thinks he's the director of our a rare KCXW camera group. Tobias does group. not want the camera on him. Yeah. Yeah. Making sure everyone paying attention to that big middle middle with that drop. killer instinct out there. Marksman really making his mark out there tonight, leaving a few marks on Bird Candy too. Marksman coming in with some chairs. Oh, he's got something else in mind here. He's just Mark Tobias and Goldman closer to Asking doing commentary Goldman with us. Storm to have a seat and watch as he does his work. The marksman just proving he doesn't need them to be Bird Candy. Another big suplex might from Bird Candy. You kidding me? Lariat from Burt Candy. Burt Candy taking over this match now that Goldman and Storm are relegated to fans this Burt Candy with a big suplex to the marksman. This crowd is pumped for Burt Candy. An unbelievable showing of power from Burt Candy. Candy takes his shirt off. He's back to being serious again, folks. The shirt is off. Going for the big candy But the tank crush. top is still on. He's not that yes. serious. Finish off. Finish off. Nobody home. Marksman stalking Burt Candy Break now. Marksman hitting him with everything he has. Right to the gut. Yeah. Knee across the sternum. Yeah. Hey, Candy, how you doing over there, buddy? Shut up! Shut up! Uh, Tobias doesn't on, even need to be by the ring to have his presence felt. The big Vader bomb. That's got to be the end of that one, folks. Marksman gets shrugged off Look hard. Look at that Burt unbelievable Candy. power by Burt Candy. Burt Candy is skewing the soft, cubby demeanor. He's hulking up into hard candy. I think he's burning up. Is that like the, the Hulk Hogan version of Burt Candy? The Burt? Across the jaw again. 
Now to the chest. Candy looking to take him across the ring. Looking for the lariat. The big sleeper for Marksman. He's got him in the sleeper hold. Look at he's got he's got the hand behind the head, definitely choking him. Bert Candy trying to shrug him off. Bert Candy looks like he's fading fast. Marksman's got the chokehold cinched in. He's fighting it with all he can, but he's going down to one hand. Taking him down. See if he can get Candy. Candy showing some spirit now. Headbutts to the back of the head. My God, the viciousness of the marksman. Marksman looks like he's got this one in his grasp. That's a one. For Candy fading now. He drops that arm one more time. This match is over, folks. That's it. That's it. Bird Candy is out, folks. Candy is out on his knees. As Goldman and Storm. Winner by submission, the Marksman. Marksman again with that sick, intense look in his eyes. Standing over Bird Candy, very impressive victory. Sending Golden and Storm to the and Like I said, this team together looks to be unstoppable. Sending his seconds to the audience. He didn't need any help tonight. Storm, Golden, and Marksman have this crowd riled up. Again, Storm getting under the skin of the KCXW audience at Marksman. Heading back to the showers. Tobias really showing off the fans. No, doubling back with his flag. Folks, let's give a standing ovation right on Marksman. Marksman really getting under the skin of the audience. He went with a valiant effort, but Marksman is just too much. That's what I'm talking about, the Marksman here, folks. This trio he's really soaking up his victory here. He's been having a lot of them lately. Enjoying his right at the top right now. This trio is dangerous for the rest of the KCXW roster. 